everyone, it's Sarah here uh, for the Wild Hair Care... <laughs> okay, let me try that again. The Wild Hair Kit Club. <laughs> Um, this is actually my second time doing this video. Um, my first one I uploaded, it was all messed up. <clears throat> Excuse me, then I went on vacation um, and was unable to film. We lost power. Um, this is essentially <laughs> the unboxing video that did not want to be unboxed, uh, which makes me sad because there is awesome goodies in my kit this month. Not that there's not every month. So I am going to go through this yet again and um, show you all the things that I got in my kit this month. So um, I put in my style profile that I was looking to do a lot of travel things for the summer. Um, and so I received a lot of things that were bright and colorful like um, I like. <clears throat> and... Um, that what else but had a lot of neutrals so that I could pair it all together um, and while this is not a travel collection or kit at all there is a lot of really nice things that um, I'll be able to use just because of the sayings and the words and all that kind of stuff so okay enough um, chit chat I am going to get started so my first piece is from Jen Hatfield patio party this is paper called tablescape a lot of bright uh, pinks and uh, oranges with some uh, black and off-white striping and the other side is a black and white polka dot okay my neck, let's see, try to make some room here. My desk is an absolute mess, I apologize. Um, the next paper is from Simple Stories, Good Vibes. And this is a really nice um, pattern paper that has a wood grain with a geometric pattern, a nice little floral element. Uh, this paper is called Be Amazing. And I really love the back. This is a geometric uh, pattern with um that is also off white so was there a brand oh the branding strip on this first paper was a really nice geometric um and so we have that next we have another paper from <clears throat> simple stories good vibes this is called you got this and i love it because in the background of many of these polka dots um, are some subtle um, texts, text, let's see here if that helps, um, trying to help you zoom in, there we go, some printing, some uh, graphs, really, really nice, I love that, and on the back is this awesome bright arrow and feather paper. This paper is called Eden, and it's from Heidi Swap's Hawthorne Collection, and this is a beautiful uh, watercolor, um, messy watercolor, tone-on-tone -tone background paper. And on the back is this awesome polka dot pattern. Slightly distressed. The polka dots are not perfect, but, um, but I love it. <coughs> Uh, another paper, I got this in my kit a couple times ago, but I loved it so much that um, Allison included it again. So this is called Patio Party from Jen Hadfield, and this paper is called Bouquets. So lots of bright colors, and on the back is an aqua and navy uh, polka dot. And then it has um, some little lantern lights hanging. <coughs> Excuse me, from Simple Stories Good Vibes. This is a cut apart sheet with a lot of fun things um, to include. This will be great for um, layering, whether you just want the pops of color, whether you're interested in a fussy cutting out some of the images on here. Um, these are really, really, really cute. I like them. And on the back is this awesome, looks like confetti. Uh, piece of paper again this is on a this is on a cream background actually so a little different than the off-white or white 
from Paige Evans' Pick Me Up collection. This is paper number 13, and this is a bunch of um, tags, labels, um, little sayings that are on banners. So really, really cute. Again, another um, element that I can add to even my traveling um, things. Things like, you know, that was so cool. Uh, positively please life is better together this is the life these are all really general sayings that while they're not specific to traveling per se you can certainly use them in um, a travel a travel themed um, scrapbook page and or book uh, the back is this awesome um, uh, it's not floral what is it it is it will come to me um, but it is, it's branches, <laughs> it's little branches um, in a beautiful um, tone on tone with an aqua, a lighter color, and then a, a purpley, royally blue. This is a gorgeous ombre um, hexagon paper. This is from Patio Party. So this is gorgeous. I love it. I don't know if it's really showing up on the camera well, but this is a much darker than it's actually appearing on camera and then fades down to a nice, um, very, very light aqua. And on the back is another cut apart sheet. This is called Patio Life from the Patio Party uh, collection. Lots of fun things. Again, can use this in all elements of scrapbooking your summers, including, um, you know, vacation type things. <coughs> Uh, this is a tag cut apart sheet from the same collection patio party. This one is called Just For You. And I was very excited about this kit. Please don't think that I wasn't. But you know, when you've having when you're having to film it two and three times, um, you kind of forget the things you've said before. So forgive me if I am not ecstatic um, about what I received because trust me, I was. The, sec the first time that I did this um, and then I got frustrated <laughs> so um, this kit it, I just I love it I love the bold colors in it I love the neutrals that Allison included and I am so excited to use um, to really use this kit the first project that I will be doing <clears throat> excuse me is a scrap lift of one of the other design team members Kira so I will be um, posting on the blog near the end of September what um, project that I scrap lifted of hers and how I used the kit to achieve that, as well as still continuing to post things on my social media um, throughout the month um, using this kit. So on the back of the tag is this awesome graph paper, and I love the branding strip. It's uh, butterflies. And then I get a lot of papers. <laughs> Love it. This is a smaller cut apart sheet. So a lot of two by twos, again, from the Patio Party collection. Um, this is um, from, sorry, the paper is called From Me to You. Uh, lots of fun things. This will be cool. In August, I celebrated my birthday, so I'll be able to add that. Um, I also got engaged on my birthday, so I'll be able to use Best Day Ever. So these are all little tiny things that you can use either to tuck in layers to use as standalone pieces um, or if you are just looking for a specific pop of color you can use um, you can use them that way as well these are also the perfect size for cards so if you knew you needed a card and you didn't really have a lot of time to you know get out your stamps or, or anything like that you know cutting this out and popping this on a card that says thank you or happy day um, is a really nice way to still be able to make a handmade card um, on the back is an irregular polka dot of black and off-white, and then the branding strip is an aqua with navy blue dots. And last but not least, in the paper um, category, we have an acetate page. I won't pull it out um, of the paper because it will... There's really no reason. Um, but the um, some of the elements on here I'm trying to show you are foiled. So where it has gold, those are gold foiled. Um, obviously where you see the white on here, it will be um, see-through on the actual piece because this is acetate. So I'm excited to use um, this in a uh, fun way uh, this month. So 
<clears throat> that is all the paper that I received. And now <clears throat> I will go through and show you the embellishments. Uh, first thing is the washi tape from the Carpe Diem collection with Simple Stories. And I love this. This is the pattern that the washi tape is. Really bright, bold, lot of washi tape. A lot, a lot of. Nice. Um, from the Pink Fresh Studio BU collection, these are the wood and epoxy buttons. So again, not the same collection that all the paper came from, but everything matches so perfectly. Allison really has a gift for and an eye for doing that. Simple Stories, Good Vibes, Bits and Pieces. A lot of fun little elements. We've got tags, we've got words, we have labels, speech bubbles, um, really cute uh, floral designs, little icons of like, you know, the shirt, and then I think that's nail polish. So fun little things like that. Love that. Next, we have the Pink Fresh uh, Studio from the collection The Mix Number no. Two. These are the Puffy Heart stickers. You get 182 of these, and I am jazzed. I love these. So you have your standard hearts, and then you have the shapes up here that are slightly more wonky and irregular. And, and I love that you get both of those types of designs um, in the same pack. So I'm really excited about those. Next, we have the from the Patio Party Collection. These are the accent stickers. You get 57 stickers in here. Again, they are gold foiled. <clears throat> Not all of them. Uh, but you get fun little summer icons like the watermelon and a flamingo. Um, a couple picnic baskets. Lots of florals. Beautiful butterflies. Um, you know, cute little badminton set. That'll be fun because we actually played badminton this year, <laughs> uh, or this summer rather. And um, yeah, just fun little summer icons. But again, these are um, generic enough that um, you could use these on a card as well. Um, you know, these drinks, you know, you could cheers somebody and um, this hat you know, Hello Sunshine, that's a very easy uh, thinking of you type card. Um, balloons. So yeah, lots of fun things to do with the, the stickers that were included in my kit this time. Uh, one of the, my favorite things that I received in my kit um, is the Alpha Bean stickers from Jilly Bean Soup. These are called Navy Diagonal. And if you look closely, you will see that the tops of each letter um, have a navy and white diagonal stripe. And then the lower half looks like it was dipped in white paint. And so you get a really nice um, look for titles or subtitles when you use stickers and alphas like this. Um, these are the perfect size. They are really a nice a nice beefy size um, without being overpowering. So this will be a really nice um, element for the pages, or for my pages rather. And then last but not least is Thickers from Escape the Ordinary. <clears throat> and I don't know what collection, if, if any, th these were assigned to, but I love them. Um, they all have sayings on them, um, or there's some border stickers which I really like because I don't know that I've ever really had a chipboard border sticker um, which I really I think those are cute again very easy to work into my travel um, my travel themes and layouts that I want to be working on um, leading up into the other projects coming up in the latter part of the the year um, but these are these will be great for me to be able to add to the you know my favorite people that's who I was traveling with uh, we had big smiles um, we were happy we were getting out and exploring so a lot of these things again while they're not travel specific um, they're going to work really, really well for what I have in mind. So this is my kit for September, and I apologize again that it's coming to you late, um, you know, but, but the saying is true, better late than never. Um, it's just sometimes technology wins, and 
I, I threw in the towel. So um, if you have not already, please subscribe to this channel so that you can see every month when I get a new kit what is included. Um, and I do believe that you are allowed in your style profile to mention some of us design team members who may have a kit that you like and can um, ask for something similar. Whether you'll get the exact products, I cannot guarantee, but you will be able to um, get things that are similar um, as, as to what some of us you know, received, if that's something that you like. Also, head over to the blog, check it out all month long. Uh, we've got an amazing design team and they are, <laughs> they are working it. They are busting projects out. And I'm excited now that uh, our summer traveling is over to be able to get back in my craft room and get some awesome projects done using these awesome supplies. So thank you again for stopping in and I appreciate you all for your comments that you leave and for subscribing. And so until next time, I will see you again. Bye.